How's it going, YouTube? Welcome back to this new episode of Restorations with Vic. What I have for you guys today are these super cooked 2011 Air Jordan Royal Blue Ones. I got these off go for a great price, but as you can see, they need a ton of work. We're gonna go in, give the shoe a proper deep clean using our rejuvenator products, remove all the creasing off the toe box, get rid of all the deep scratches and scuffs all over the leather, and repaint the black and repaint the blue. We got a lot of work ahead of us, guys, so without further ado, let's get it going. The first step we're gonna do, guys, is put this shoe to the side since we're only gonna be working on the left shoe. First step we gotta do is take out our shoelaces and take out our insoles. Shoelaces are out, guys. The insoles are not gonna come out. They're glued tight. If I try pulling it out, it's gonna rip. So we're just gonna go ahead and pop in our adjustable rejuvenated shoe tree and adjust it to size. This step is very important because it's gonna help us reshape the toe box on this shoe. All prepped, ready to go. Let's go ahead and square two squares of our rejuvenated solution inside our collapsible bowl. Boom, bam, ready to go. The first brush we're gonna be using is our soft bristle brush. We're gonna use this brush to attack the upper so it can start breaking down all the grime. Uppers are looking a lot better, guys. There's still a lot of stains on the leather. We'll use the medium bristle brush to get all that stuff out. But what we're gonna do next is shift our focus on the insides of the shoe with the soft bristle brush still. Insides and the tongue are looking really good. Now let's put the soft bristle brush to the side, jump back to the uppers using our medium bristle brush. Okay, all done with the medium bristle brush. Let's finish off this cleaning by getting these soles all cleaned up using our stiff bristle brush. <laughs> Nothing happened. Pre-treatment's good to go on this shoe. Before we wrap it up and put this shoe inside the single laundry bag and put them in the washing machine, we're gonna go ahead and pre-treat the shoelaces real quick inside our leftover solution in our bowl. take this party to the wash. Let's go ahead and put this royal inside the washing machine, grab our detergent, and squeeze and pour one full ounce. Let's close this bad boy up. As always, guys, use cold water with the regular cycle, always. We are back YouTube. We got the shoe fully cleaned up and dried and disinfected thanks to our three brush advanced single laundry system and our detergent. Now moving on with this restoration guys, we gotta remove the yelling off these midsoles. We're gonna be using Salon Care 40, Ceram Wrap, and the Sun. 
Let's go ahead and apply it using a little paintbrush. Let's take a trip to the sun. All done removing the yellowing off the midsoles, guys. They look a lot better. We're making some progress on this restoration. The shoe is still pretty beat up. So the next thing we gotta do is a lot of prep work. On these uppers, specifically the toe box, is pretty shredded up. So we gotta smooth all that out before we can go ahead and paint it. We're gonna be using 400 grit sandpaper, 800 grit sandpaper, and 1200 grit sandpaper to get this as smooth as possible before the repaint. Let's do it. All done sanding guys, took a lot of work to get it to this point. It's still a little rough, but that's as smooth as it's gonna get. The toe box was super shredded. Now to finish out the prep work, we're gonna use acetone and cotton balls to finish smoothing out the leather. While we're at it, we're also gonna go in and remove all the old glue from separation so we can go in and fix that. All done prepping the shoe guys, now let's move on to some gluing. We're gonna break this up to the three different parts. One, two, and three. We're gonna start off by taping off the uppers so we can go in, apply bar to finish cement glue on both the uppers and the sole. Once it's applied, we're gonna let it cure for about seven minutes, then we're gonna clamp it together. All done with the glue job, you guys. Turned out good. Now let's move on to the next step in this restoration, which is the iron method. We're gonna use the iron method to remove the creasing off the toe box. The first step you wanna do is stuff the toe box using an old towel. Then you're gonna wanna place a wet towel over the toe box and then simply iron it out. Good to go with the toe box, guys. Looks a lot better. Got rid of the majority of the creasing. There's still a little bit there, but overall, it looks a lot better. Now let's move on to some taping. We're gonna tape off the sole before we get started painting.
all taped up, fully prepped, ready to go. Let's go ahead and lay down our pre-mixed royal blue color. The colors I used to mix this color was blue, sapphire, cream, navy blue, purple, and a little bit of red. We'll lay it down using an angler brush. All done laying down the blue paint, guys. Looks super nice, it was super satisfying to do. Now let's move on to the second color, which is the black paint. Paint job is good to go on this shoe, looks a lot better. Now the next step you gotta do to protect this paint job is go outside, spray with some crawl on matte finish so we can come back and lace this shoe up. gonna be in on this full restoration on these 2016 Air Jordan 1 Royals. This shoe was super trashed. We went in using our three brush advanced signal art system and our detergent to get the shoe fully cleaned up inside and out. Once the cleaning process was all done, we moved on to removing the yellowing off the soles using Salon Care for in the sun. We brought them back inside, did a lot of prep work on the uppers, specifically in the toe box using the sandpaper method. Then we reglued the soles, removed the creasing of the toe boxes using the iron method. Then we finished off this restoration by giving the uppers a fresh repaint. You can find all the stuff you see right here at rejuvenator.com, guys. Use my promo code in the description below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is Vic Almighty. I'll see you guys next Monday.